Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Bilal Wahab. I am the uh, director of Center for Development and Natural Resources at the American University of Iraq, Soleimani. I'm also an, an assistant professor here. Uh, I welcome you to this conference entitled Escaping the Rentier Model, Reforms in Iraq and Kurdistan Region, where we discuss important issues and challenges facing the Iraqi and Kurdish economies and governments. Before I get to uh, tremendous pressure, security, military, demographic, and above all, economic. Although some of these pressures are exogenous, many unfortunately are self-inflicted. The war against ISIS, low oil international prices, and the tectonic shifts in the wider region have resulted in economic crises across Iraq and Kurdistan. Exacerbating these crises, however, have been the state institution's inability to prepare for and mitigate the current financial tsunami or to navigate it into safety. People suffer today due to lax policies and uncontrolled spending of the past decade. We do need short-term solutions to alleviate the ongoing pains, but we must also prepare for the next boom and bust cycle. Economic shocks and revenue volatility resulting from unstable oil prices are not new to Iraq uh, or to other neighboring petro states, although it is to Kurdistan, an emerging petro region. As an academic institution dedicated to public service, the American University of Iraq Soleimani and its research centers seek to convene academics, policymakers, and industry and civil society representatives to debate pressing and strategic issues like the ones that we're having today. Speakers at this conference will analyze the current economic crisis from different angles. Panel discussions will address petroleum policy, responses to revenue volatility, economic diversification, and modernizing the public finance system. Despite the response to the current economic crisis, we should also take a step back and ask, what is the vision and strategy for an Iraqi and KRG economic system that is stable and conducive to development and prosperity? Again, I welcome you to AUIS and to this academic platform. Now I'd like to invite uh, American University of Iraq Soleimani's uh, interim president, uh, Professor Esther Mulnix to give the welcoming speech. Thank you very much, Dr. Esther. Thank you, hello. Dear esteemed guests, colleagues, friends, and global community, welcome back to your house of study, the American University of Iraq, Suleimani. We have come together here today to listen to experts in the field of economics and natural resources and to support the scholarly efforts of the Center for Development and Natural Resources and his director, Dr. Bilal A. Wahab. We are indeed experiencing very difficult times and despite the civil unrest with constant threats to our security, here we all are. To have a dialectic about economics and our developing democratic values here in Kurdistan, in Iraq. We, human beings, are capable of great productive things. Let us dialogue and affirm our convictions to make a better world one that can be built with our different ways of seeing, our different ways of thinking. Thank you all for your presence.